Shot clock again under 10. And Thor will fire up a three and hit two. Without forcing it. Look at the hands by Thor on the backside steal. Thor on the finish. Yes, plus one. Freshman in transition. It's come a long way. Smith who... Oh! <laughs> Puts it on the deck. Oh, excellent feed. Thor. The tide on the move. Oh, and a giveaway. JT Thor! Turnovers. And less than 40% from the field. Not going to get it done. Credit Alabama's defenses. Can't survive that way. Thor pulls up mid do that. We've got to find ways to score around the hoop. John Fulkerson has not been as productive as he was last year. He, he struggled the most in the to clean up the offensive glass. Defensive Thor glass. almost able to throw it down. Had it bothered and then it... Great play by Springer to just ride Cambridge off, not allow him to get into the lane and then elevate show. See if he can light it up from three. He's a good shooter. Instead, JT4 able to win the ball when you're at Auburn right now. Now you're without Cooper tonight. And you can kind of question, well, what are we playing for? I, I don't think they are built to, to win six games in a row. Okay. Uh, and it's interesting to me, Ravi, Alabama. Rebounded by Dylan Cardwell. Devin Cambridge picked up his third foul that last trip down for Auburn. Chance for the Tigers. That are capable, able, capable to do that. And when I said play through contact, at 6'6", 210, he can overpower and go through a lot of guys. So... A team, that's what makes a team like Baines block about six shots per game, so everything should be contested, especially down deep. Both top five in college, shoot, especially under the basket. Auburn had lost three in a row to Baylor, Georgia, and Ole Miss. Cooper. Four, a three. Boy, climbs the ladder. Yeah, two guys trying to block a shot. Nobody gets a body. Four. Wow. Jay rings out. Rebound battle, scooped up, Thor turns and connects. And his wife Stephanie welcomed a baby girl into the world this week. Adeline Ruth wins Auburn down by four to Kentucky. Cooper needs help, lob it in. Thor turns, bakes it in. By Kentucky just then, one that they obviously needed. Cooper gets in, reverse no, tip and go. The first half, uh, almost half of the Commodore's points tonight. point scorers on this roster a lot of upperclassmen for the rebels Thor in the lane ties oh, get the touch Thor down the lane count it right now Thor. there's Jamal Johnson struggling from deep Thor on the glass both of these teams possession rebounded by Thor here's Cooper open floor Took it down with him. Thor follows it up. Drive to the basket. And he's going to shoot it. And a big three. Williams being harassed by Thombo. Feed inside. Thor able to put it in. Bruce Pearl was our colleague. I worked a, a lot of games. He, he told Bruce, me. He was, he was fun. Well, Fran for Schiller, or Boog and Fran, if you prefer. Inside, Thor. Sharif Cooper. How about that? How about JT Thor? Rust whatsoever. He had a double-double on Saturday. In the first half against... And a win that was particularly satisfying, I would say, for Juan Conzo Martin. Here tonight, flexing its muscles defensively. Alan Flanagan, needs four. There's Thor, lines it up. Not Cooper. JT Thor will try for three, and he'll not. Mm -hmm. and, uh, or beyond. Not step yeah. off the gas. That's not who they are. In terms of we didn't defend the, the backboard well, we didn't stay in front of the ball, and that's I think that's that's Alabama. They had an account. It was quick. Well, that last the last fight for him about a year ago, right against Cowboy, that was over in a in a flash. Double world for him will be the uh, the rebounding aspect. He's got six. He need to crash the glass hard. 
Poked away by Thor. Goes to Coast. Talking to the team right now about winning this segment. Close the half by winning this last two plus. JT's Thor. Arkansas has gotten to this point because they've taken the ball out of Cooper's hands. Thor wide open. Seven scoring. Yep. Thor again, and right now. Five star. Alan Flanagan in a more natural position. Instead of having to run the point, JT Thor. Off a characteristic for them. Remember, that's a team that only lost six times all season. On the floor for the dogs. Start this second half. Here's JT Thor, the step back triple, and it's good. Rivalry, and Primo looks like he's 28 years old playing. He has been solid so far. Oh, the reason I said earlier, possession, bad shot, take a force one, is what you just saw. Reese hits the shot. Look at this. There's no reason not to drop her the other way. Cambridge. Thor. Sixteen points, six rebounds for Bruner. Cooper, the hesitation, finds Thor. They should still be in high school. We've seen a lot of players college basketball this year do that so that they could play and Thor Monte Schuler trying to get it to white turns it over Thor leads the fast break little Euro step some early 2022 mock drafts and on cue off the mark offensive rebound is good for JT Thor another talented friend Thor's going to have to heave one up, and the freshman from the wing, and it's all net. So for Auburn, what you're telling me, Professor, you want to see more passing, less dribbling. Thor on command. Again, two possessions. Thor, three on one. Alley-oop on the way. Thor with a putback. Ooh, that's a There's a steal. Pass. Chandler lost possession. Inside to Thor, and we're tied. Both these teams play with such freedom on the offensive end and they I think they do a good job of understanding freedom means what is Auburn's best shot understanding who should be taking shots the right people on the right spots on the floor that's a good spot right there good find Flanagan kick out past Thor with an open three got it to go Jay playing with uber confidence the freshman from Kentucky JT Thor yeah Powell, Rob, four. And of course, think the world of their leader. Well, Kevin, the few games we've had together, so scoreboard once. These guys keep playing each possession like it's down to crunch time, and their sense of urgency has been through the roof. Bill Brown at LSU went to the Final Four and put himself in a position to get back involved in coaching. Was a great recruiter. Alexander is a key component to this team. Uh, He's a Georgetown transfer. She's that opening stanza. Bit of a force. That's with a point guard position that struggles. Largest lead for Memphis. Oh. Bank is open for. Bad pass. Auburn on a run out. Thor all the way. Foul and count the basket. Want to be good defensively, you have to rebound. And, and Richie Riley talked, we have to keep Auburn off the glass. But first and foremost, the one thing you guys didn't get to show up on campus and do workouts. So it, it, it's everything's new for new players. Uh, going to Flanagan looking at a three-pointer, offensive rebound, four down inside, and he will finish that with a had it knocked away by Powell, and now numbers for Auburn. Johnson trying to get back in the Pretty. play. It's four.